Now the word subluxation it basically means a partial dislocation of the shoulder which is characterized by just getting the upper arm bone just drops out of the shoulder socket. 80% of the stroke patients do come with this problem. We see the causes is basically because of as I said muscle weakness of the shoulder joint. Second is the gravitational pull and the weight of the limb which just constantly being applied to the shoulder. Third is lack of improper positioning and fourth is a most important is inappropriate handling of this patient's shoulder by the caregivers or the family members or whoever is dealing with the patient. Not all subluxation patients do complain of pain. How do we manage this? As I said, it's due to the unsupported shoulder. The shoulder needs to be supported 24 by 7. Now, how do we support the shoulder? It's basically by the usage of the straps or the slings which we prescribe them. Proper positioning by the use of the pillows on either sides whenever they sit or sleep. The straps has to be put on whenever the patient is sitting upright and you should not sleep on the affected side you sleep on the good side avoid sleeping on that side range of movement of the shoulder has to be very 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 gentle shoulder pulley should never be used in such case of patients basically then we give electrical stimulation because it has shown a great evidence in preventing the shoulder subluxation as sin and also to maintain the normal shoulder contour. In conclusion, I just want to emphasize the caregivers, the family members or whoever is dealing with these patients has to be given proper education as in how to handle the patient during sitting up or sit to stand or any kind of transfers to the chair, to the car, etc. They have to be educated properly just to prevent any further complications.